subscribe to RA Solutions by clicking on the subscribe button and clicking on the bell icon to receive notifications. Hello there, welcome to another video about RA Solutions. In this one, what I'm going to do is show you how to annotate and label a PowerPoint presentation whilst it's being whilst it's in a slideshow mode. So I've got a PowerPoint presentation here using Microsoft PowerPoint and obviously I've got four slides on that PowerPoint presentation there. Now what I'm going to do is um, show you very quickly how to annotate this in slideshow mo mode. Let's say you're going through this presentation with, with your audience or you're delivering a lesson with some pupils this is what you would do so obviously you go into slideshow mode by clicking on here and this is my key stage 3 lesson I'm delivering to my pupils and then I'll go through my lesson and let's go through this one and obviously I'll go through keywords in this specific slide here to do this bottom left hand corner you've got some options here these this is to go back a slide this is to go forward a slide this one here the third option here will allow you to choose a pen a laser pointer or a highlighter and change the color of your highlighter there so let's choose orange um, but not only that you can click on that again and choose whether you want a pen or whether you want a highlighter and uh, I in this case want to highlight certain keywords so I'm going to click on the highlighter there when I'm going, going through my um, question here, how do I use the school network effectively? If there's specific keywords that we come across, we will highlight those keywords there. So I'm, I've highlighted network and I've highlighted the word effectively there as well. You can go back, change the color of my highlighter. Let's say I want to choose orange now. Choose orange, obviously, like that. Now, some of you have asked me whether you can change the thickness or the width of your highlight or the size of your highlighter pen. You can. You can't do it in when you're in slideshow mode. You can do it when, when you have finished the slideshow mode. So let me show you what I mean. So when I go through my slide, let me um, choose some more definition, you know, um, highlight some more keywords, go through it more. When I finish that, it will come up with this message here. Do you want to keep your ink annotations? If I say keep. Now, if I go to my other slide here, you can see um, that obviously these words here have been highlighted. So if I click on one of the highlighted words, so network has been highlighted. On the right side, it will bring some key options. Format ink. Now, obviously, if that format ink is not available, if you're in this mode here, you can highlight the annotations, right click, go to format ink there from the drop down list. And it will bring this section up here. Now from here, you can change, change the color again of your annotation. You can change the width of your annotation. So the bigger the number, the bigger the highlight. Uh, um, the bit that's highlighted so look how big big that's become now in terms of there and there's lots of different options you can change there so when I go back to my annotation mode or my slideshow show mode you can see that word now has been highlighted I've changed managed to change the color uh, managed to change the size of that highlighted word now Unfortunately, you can't change the settings whilst you're in slideshow mode. So if I go back to the bottom left hand corner, click on the third option, choose my highlighter, choose a different color. Let's choose green this time. You will notice it will revert back to the default size of your highlightings. OK, so the only way to change the settings of your um, pointer, so to speak, is only when after you have finished your slideshow click on keep um, obviously go back to the um, word which is highlighted click on it right click format ink and then you can change the thickness size and width of your highlighter and that was just a quick and easy video showing you how to annotate your PowerPoint presentation how to change the settings of your pointer um, let me do one more thing before I leave click on slideshow mode if I don't want to highlight it, let's say if I want to choose a pen, choose the pen, let's choose um, blue. You can even um, draw arrows 
ask your audience what this refers to that's a question mark by the way and you can do lots of different labelings and annotations as you see fit so obviously to keep those annotations end your PowerPoint presentation when this message appears you all you simply do is click on keep um, and when I go back onto that slide you can see my annotations have been kept there you can change the options in those annotations again you can change the width and whatever the colors there to your heart's content um, as you see fit I hope this video has helped um, please like subscribe and share